All right, no time to waste. Let's get right into this hamstring isolation workout. You guys are going to love slash hate me after this. Getting right into it. Grab a plate, 25 pound, 45 pound, place it under your front foot. Grab a barbell. You're going to be performing this move as shown in the video demo, okay? You're gonna be running that barbell uh, right behind your leg, okay? It's almost like you're gonna try to outline it. Um, this is going to put all of your weight on that front leg and you're going to need to push yourself back up. You shouldn't have a lot of lower back pain with this move. All right, going right into the second round. Okay, notice that there are pulses just from the knee, the back of the knee all the way to the bottom. Guys, pulses are one of my favorite things to do for isolating those hamstrings. Okay, you're very rarely going to get your back into it and your glutes won't be as engaged, okay, because you're not gonna fully squeeze them. Following both of those moves on the same leg, you're gonna perform this specific move. Watch the video closely. You're gonna perform the original move, and you're gonna bring the barbell backwards, bring your back upright, and you're going to perform, a, uh, like basically you're gonna stand up into the lunge, all right, or the Bulgarian split squat, whichever one you wanna call it. So you're gonna fo come forward, Bring that back knee down, and then you're going to lift your entire body up with that barbell, all right? Once again, all the same leg first until you do the second leg. We're going right into the technically fourth move, all right? Notice that my toes are on top of plates. My heels are on the floor. You're going to notice my toes are also pointed out, guys. I want to engage the outer portion of my hamstrings. And you're going to notice I am also incorporating a pulse rep in between these. Basically, it's a sumo variation of a straight-legged deadlift, okay? So you're going to continue. Keep your back as straight as possible. Try not to arch it, and that should help reduce your lower back pain. All right, you're gonna feel that stretch in your hamstrings the entire time. One thing I love about these voiceovers is I can actually educate you a little bit more on these moves as opposed to you guys just watching me do them. So this one in particular, I wanted to talk to you about real quick. Notice I added two plates. The, the plates regardless of what anyone says, they truly help with a little bit of range of motion. You see how that barbell is coming down below those plates. That little bit of range of motion is so important. And I can, I, I'm telling you, give it a try because this will really step up your hamstrings. <laughs> step up your hamstring game, okay? Notice that my back is super straight with my glutes, my upper back, my shoulders, okay? This is to help alleviate any lower back pain. You're going to notice I stay all the way at the bottom and I only come up to my knees. And I'm just throwing this one in as a final finisher, a final burnout. Oh my God, you guys are going to die. Uh, I just also wanted to thank you so much all for being here, watching my videos, being a part of my journey and allowing me to be a part of yours. Um, it means the world to me. So please comment below. Give this uh, video a double tap. Let me know that you guys like it. And I always appreciate hearing from you guys in the comment section or DMs. So I will see you guys in the next one. Love you all. Bye.